Well, just south of Topeka this morning, three high school buddies from Catonsville, Maryland, passed through Shawnee County at about 20 miles an hour. Riding stripped down bicycles, the trio is making a trip of a lifetime, all for a very good cause. 49 Sports Director Nick Griffith has the story. Their journey is a long one. Uh, we started in Bellingham, Washington, which is up near Vancouver, and uh, we we're going to be ending in Ocean City, Maryland. Total miles? Uh, it'll be about roughly around 7,000. All done on this, a gearless bicycle. Yeah, we don't have the gears. It's a single speed fixed gear bike, so we can't coast either. So going down the hills, we got to pedal real fast. This is day 50 of a 90 day journey for this crew. The goal today, Osage City to Kansas City. They woke up at 4.30 this morning to beat the heat. Uh, the wind, wind and the sun. Um, the mountains were nothing compared to the two, those two. Uh, yeah, biggest challenge is, I guess just for me, the day-to-day -day grind, just getting up every morning and getting back on the bike for eight to 10 hours, you know, it's just, I don't know, it starts to wear on you after a while, more so mentally than physically. But despite the hardships, no matter which great state they're in, we love Kansas! Woo! The trio continues to pedal in hopes of pumping money and awareness into two organizations, the American Diabetes Association and Kupunda, which aids disability children in Africa. Yeah, basically just trying to do a good thing, give back. We want to inspire other people, just prove to other people with diabetes you can do anything. We're really good at like biking and running and stuff and endurance athletics. So we figured we use that stuff that we love so much to make a difference and raise some money for some good causes. For 49 Sports, I'm Nick Griffith.